I want to show you how I hooked up this 100 watt solar panel to my little power generator inside my cabin. Powers my record player and my lights and my devices. This is a 500 watt power generator. There's all different kinds and types on the market. I want to show you how to hook up yours to solar. Super simple. Stay tuned. The first thing I needed to do was rig some type of stand. I just used my chainsaw to cut a piece of leftover treated lumber I had from building the cabin. And if you want to see me build this cabin, I'll put a link below. So this janky setup I'm dealing with now was actually a stand that I bought and didn't have the directions once I got it there a year later. So I was just rigging it up to make it work for this piece of lumber I had. A little reinforcement with another piece and my stand was good to go. Next step was to set up the extended cables that I got just for this project. These are 30 foot uh, solar panel extension cables and all that's required is just connecting the right cable to the right connection and I was good to go. Now it was time to run those cables to the location where I wanted them to enter the cabin. Just drilled a hole big enough to fit the heads of the cables through and now I could go to the other side. Okay, now that I have my two cables through, I can get everything attached. This is just a, I think it's just a Chinese made brand, Chiffon. They've changed, I have a different one that's exactly the same with a different name, but man, these are great. It's a 500 watt uh, power station. So these are nice, they already have the inverter and everything built in. So it comes with uh, a plug for solar and you just plug that in. Now I use this for my lights and my record player and charging my other stuff. So now that I have that plugged in, I can plug in the rest. Okay, there is the plug going out of the unit into my solar, which goes outside. I have a little bit of a mess to clean up and I'm gonna have to plug that hole with I don't know, spray foam or something there. Now I have that and you can see the red button here says it is charging. So how cool is that? I have this attached to solar now. So we are in business. I have this thing to 93.5% right now. I haven't used much of it. So there it is. Just to recap, just a regular 100 watt solar panel. This happens to be a Renogy. Hook it up to some solar extension cables. These are 30 foot cables going to my cabin. Drilled a hole through the wall. Stuffed the cables through. Pulled it out the other side. Hook it up to my power generator. And we are good to go. Now the power generator you have may come with a different cable, but at the end of the day, they will hook up the same way to your solar panel. There you go guys, hope you liked the video. Endless records now, woohoo! I'll see you in the next one. This girl in the woods, she gone. Oh, don't forget to get outside and get happy.